third square of capital M or an equilateral triangle. Equilateral triangle means the angle is 60 degree. Okay. A fourth sphere of mass is placed at the center of triangle. The net gravitational force on that center sphere from the other three spheres are zero. So net force acting on central is zero. What is M in terms of M? What is the capital value in terms of M? If you double the value of M4, if you double the value of M4, what is the magnitude of gravitational force and center? And you say, going to take it. So first we need to find the net gravitational force acting on the fourth mass by the other masses. Unget or mass is clear? Unget or mass is clear? All are placed on an equilateral triangle, right? Equilateral triangle. So this is like equilateral triangle. Here mass 1, mass 2 and capital M. So force acting on mass 4 by this mass, this mass is attractive force. This is attractive, this is attractive, this is also attractive. This mass attractive like this, this mass attractive like this, this mass attractive like this. What is angle here? Angle is 60 degree. We know that an equilateral triangle angle is 60 degree. So this angle 60 degree means, what is angle of this position vector? This is 30. Same as this is 30. This is our 90 degree vertical force, vertically upward. Okay, if we resolve the force, this force, result in an hour, render prima. If I resolve for the body, Ungal Kondi, honest theta cancel out, cut up a dinner, Tanya could have already. If I resolve for the body, in the angle of Ulka, the angle and here the 30 degree. So we get uh, the force, force acting on this particle 2. The particle 1, 2, 3. This is 1, this is 2. Particle 1 on uh, central mass is cos 30 degree. Remember, this is the inverse force. The result is the right word or result is the downward or result is So this is F cos 30. Denominator is the F sin 30. Remember, this is F sin 30. Then the F sin 30 is 2 F sin 30. So this cos 30 rightward and leftward forces are cancelled out. So we have the downward force. Downward force, two, two downward force. F y sin 30 by mass 1. F y sin 30 by mass 2. Both are equal. equal in magnitude okay but total force is equal to what 2 f y sin 30 downward direction j curve direction so minus okay from this observation the central mass is placed here which is the central mass we have a downward force which is which one is 2 f y sin 30 degree. Another force is upward force. The value of upward force is the force passed by the capital M. Capital M on M4. So, if the net gravity forces are zero means both vectors are equal, equal and in opposite direction. From this observation, the force acting on the M4 
y the capital m is equal to rendu force um balanced each other rendu balanced a irundala ungalku enna kedaikum zero gravitational force so substitute the values e capital m m4 divided by the distance between the what is the radial distance here for equilateral triangle here theta is cos 30 degree this is the height this is the length so paadi aprikum length l by 2 varum uh, cos 30 is equal to adjacent by the hypotenuse hypotenuse equal to l by 2 by cos 30 cos 30 is root 3 by 2 by simplification r is equal to l by root this length is l by root 3 This length is L by root three, L by root three. So the R squared is L by root three the whole square. That is equal to two into F Y. F Y means force acting on M one to M four by any force. M two M four by the R squared here also L by root three the whole square. Sine theta, sine theta. So the M4, M4 are cancelled out. L by 3 whole square are cancelled out. Sine theta is 1 by 2, so 2s also cancel. The G is equal to G in cancel. So capital M is equal to the small M. It is bending the near here. Sine theta is 1 by 2. 2 is 2. 2, 2s are cancelled. So capital M is equal to small M. This is the answer. So the value of capital M is equal to the value of the small M. Next, if you double the central force M4, mass of the central point is double. What happens to the gravitational force? This central point force is not related with the gravitational force, not contributed to the gravitational force because the gravitational force at the point P created by the these vertices, mass masses are placed at these vertices. These Three forces only create the force at the center point. So, if you change the value of this mass, it's not effective. If you change this mass into two times, the gravitational power value force at the center point is changed. Very easy. Understand? 